The British Army will soon have new artillery that can fire on the move. The UK has signed a £52 million contract with Germany for state-of-the-art military artillery. The Ministry of Defence said, the deal means the UK will receive a cutting-edge early capability demonstrator platform of the RCH-155, with two more going to Germany for joint testing. The joint procurement demonstrates deepening defence cooperation between the UK and Germany under the Trinity House Agreement signed in October 2024 a landmark defense agreement that committed both nations to military collaboration, the Ministry of Defense added. RCH-155 is a long-term solution for the British Army's mobile fires platform requirement. Soldiers currently operate the 14 Archer artillery systems, which are the short-term replacement for the AS-90 guns gifted to Ukraine. In modern warfare, artillery remains one of the most decisive elements on the battlefield. While drones, cyber warfare, and precision missiles often dominate headlines, it is artillery that continues to deliver sustained firepower, deep strike capability, and battlefield dominance. Today, the United Kingdom is taking a bold step to redefine what modern artillery should look like. At the center of this transformation is the RCH-155, a highly mobile, fully automated artillery system designed to meet the demands of 21st century combat. In this video, we'll explore how the RCH-155 represents the future of British Army artillery, why it matters, and how it reflects the UK's evolving military doctrine. For the British Army, the RCH-155 represents more than just a new howitzer, it reflects a broader modernization strategy. As older systems approach the end of their service life, the UK is prioritizing mobility, survivability, and digital warfare integration. For decades, traditional artillery systems relied on heavy, tracked platforms with large crews and lengthy deployment times. While powerful, these systems were often slow to move, vulnerable to counter-battery fire, and logistically demanding. Modern conflicts, especially those observed in Eastern Europe and the Middle East, have shown that survivability now depends on speed, automation, and precision. Artillery units must be able to fire, relocate, and re-engage before the enemy can respond. This shift has forced armies around the world to rethink artillery design. The British Army is no exception, and the RCH-155 is its answer to this new reality. The RCH-155, or Remote Controlled Howitzer 155, is a wheeled, self-propelled artillery system developed by Rainmetal. It combines a 155mm L-52 gun with a highly mobile 8x8 armored vehicle platform. What makes the RCH-155 unique is its fully automated turret, capable of operating without crew members inside. All firing, loading, and targeting functions are controlled remotely from within the armored cab, or potentially from an external command vehicle in the future. This design significantly enhances crew survivability while also increasing firing speed and operational flexibility. One of the most revolutionary aspects of the RCH-155 is its automation. Traditional artillery systems require crews to operate exposed gun positions, often under threat from drones, loitering munitions, and counter-artillery strikes. With the RCH-155, the crew remains protected inside an armored cabin, reducing risk from shrapnel, small arms fire, and blast effects. The automated loading system also minimizes physical strain and fatigue, allowing for longer operational endurance. In modern warfare, where seconds can mean survival, this level of automation is not just an advantage, it is a necessity. Mounted on a wheeled platform rather than tracked, the RCH-155 offers exceptional strategic and tactical mobility. It can travel faster on roads, requires less maintenance, and can be rapidly deployed across long distances. This mobility supports the critical shoot and scoot tactic, firing a mission and relocating immediately to avoid enemy detection and retaliation. In future conflicts, where counter-battery radars and drones can detect firing positions almost instantly, this capability will be essential for artillery survival. The RCH-155 is designed to integrate seamlessly with modern battlefield networks. Advanced fire control systems allow it to receive targeting data from drones, reconnaissance units, and command centers in real-time. 
This means faster target acquisition, improved accuracy, and the ability to engage multiple targets with minimal delay. The system is also capable of multiple rounds simultaneous impact, where several shells fired at different trajectories land on a target at the same time. This level of precision transforms artillery from a blunt force weapon into a highly responsive and intelligent battlefield tool. For the British Army, the RCH-155 represents more than just a new howitzer, it reflects a broader modernization strategy. As older systems approach the end of their service life, the UK is prioritizing mobility, survivability, and digital warfare integration. The RCH-155 aligns with NATO standards, supports rapid deployment alongside allies, and ensures the British Army remains relevant in high-intensity conflicts. It also signals a shift towards smaller, more agile forces that rely on technology and speed rather than mass alone. Looking ahead, the RCH-155 could serve as the foundation for future developments, including unmanned operations, extended-range munitions, and deeper integration with AI-driven battlefield systems. As warfare continues to evolve, artillery will remain a key pillar of military power, but only for those who adapt. With the RCH-155, the UK is not just modernizing its artillery, it is redefining how artillery fights, survives, and wins in the modern battle space. The RCH-155 represents a step change in mobile artillery, combining devastating firepower with the ability to rapidly reposition. The UK has signed a £52 million contract with Germany for state-of-the-art military artillery. As part of the contract, the UK and Germany will share test data and facilities, ensuring both nations get world-class equipment. This means both nations are accelerating procurement timelines whilst reducing costs, delivering better value for taxpayers and enhanced capability for both armed forces. If you found this breakdown of the RCH-155 and the future of British artillery interesting, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.